It's time to earn your beads, ML Fanatics. We are live from the Terror Dome in New Orleans, Louisiana. And second thought, since most of you are trolls, orcs, and or uh, rotting, go ahead and keep those shirts on and just write the commission for your free beads. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The New York Tyrants go up against the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row, because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. <laughs> well, as a quarterback, you have to take risks and just chuck the ball sometimes. But it, and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. <laughs> and it's first and goal. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps offside to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Ouch, that's got to hurt. Man, those mutant traps will kill you faster than one of Brick's farts. Second down and ten. Three yard catch on him. That's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And that'll bring up third down and seven. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. A routine field goal, but as you know, nothing is routine in this league. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. He 
he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Third and two. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how much throw interception. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> But, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Boom, dead and down. He delivered. He zigged when he should have zagged and ends up a shish kebab. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Ravy blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Second down and more than the QB would like. Great run for a nine-yard gain. and four. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, nice hit. Well, that's a strange penalty call right there. I'm sad to notice that this ref likes talking, and he don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. First down and three. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps outside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. First down and one. what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Huh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And that'll bring up third and one. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown! Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kick in half? they just be called... The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Now, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, at the all-you-can-eat buffets, they're not as literal as you'd think. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Third down and three. is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. A lifesaver there. First down and nine. You can't kill the quarterback. Throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Holy crap! He runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. First and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. Three on a short pass. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And that'll bring up third down and seven. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now and he's going to try and score. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. First and ten. Oh, come on, that was a 
cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. Second down in a mile. Don't worry. If he shocks you to death, maybe he can shock you to death till I left him. Yeah, I'm not sure it works that way in the end. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every yard. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't down. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. Your time for talent? I'm only how much you. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. Smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Oh, ho, ho. That gets me every time. Like a jack and the offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. First and two. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. 
He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. He could go all the way. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and two. You've got to catch that. Third and two. Put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose! Uh, unless you're in a sleeping contest. For a kick this far, you just gotta kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim! It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Brex, I'm stopping it right there. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And the defense is on his heels. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Now, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on a bench. He probably cramped his pants. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he... Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Second down in a very lot. What time? 
When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard. I... Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. Third down and long. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the 30. First down. Give this guy a few catches. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I had to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stopping time. Oh, and... Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And it's first. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit set. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. <laughs> Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. You might want to try hurling those traps next time. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Second and three. Kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing.
Second down and a lot. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a run. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. Sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not young. First down and six. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Brixton. It means he can return it for. You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Touchdown! I don't know if you're aware of this, but for every touchdown he scores, he drinks the blood of his enemies and donates $1,000 to a local children's hospital. What a player. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. First and four.
Second down and five. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and five. Hot one, hot two. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy. Give him a bottle of hot sauce shoved up your ass. Quite the description of that painful hit, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's a question here on this online dating profile. It doesn't say if on purpose or by accident. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wynn, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't know the funeral expenses that is. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's gonna kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message. Because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. Second down and long. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, man, he just crushed him. <laughs> I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you gotta pay attention. Yeah, a lot of the jungle, you know? Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else. Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. I'm 
I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just throw it to the guy in the same color. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? <laughs> First and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback sharing when he was in his cleats are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score he's running out of gas now oh man he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy gotta love it he should bite his head off right on court man the third quarter has ended and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting and it's first and ten Second down and more than the QB would like. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh, my God. I thought his head was going to pop off like a big zip. And it's first and ten. First and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Traps will kill you faster than one of Brick's farts. And it's first and ten. It's like when you shuffle your socks on a carpet and zap your sister. He, oh, he took a leap and hit the ball, knocked out, fumble. He's got a case of fumbleitis. He's at the 40. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo! I got bingo, Grim. The 20. Oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. The defense is relentless out there, and they get the turnover. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Holy crap! He mistimed the spikes and ends up dead. Life is full of misery, Grim. Loneliness, suffering, and then it's over much too soon. The defense is down to their final defensive back. So they're pretty much hosed for the rest of the game. At this point, maybe they should just let the offense score. Well, that's certainly an uh, interesting strategy there, uh, you proposed, Bricks. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. 
You don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. The lineman swants the ball away with those meaty paws. What? It looks so snugly. Yeah, I guess if you're a monster. Second down and ten. down and well good luck and the two minute warning sounds they'll have to regroup during this timeout third down and the punter is warming up ah, another interception geez you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined you'd expect him not to play like total shit no arguments for oh great tackle when his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Hey, guys, this isn't funny. I swear to drunk, I'm not pot, but seriously, stay in drugs, eat school, don't do vegetables. He's not going down. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my face. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. The offense is running low on receivers. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First down and three. For six, touchdown, touchdown! I will outshiver Shiva. I am a hell of a fella.
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> and he's off to the races! The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And that's another turnover for the defense. And that mutant just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was made in... The offense lost their last receiver on that play. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. Hey, man, I was here on the now. You know what happened? And the defense uses their second timeout to stop the clock to preserve time for their offense. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And that's the last timeout. The D has to either break the clock or the offense if they want to win. Hey, as long as something gets broke, right? Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just... It was total carnage today, folks. A gruesome and bloody mess with a high depth toll. And the hometown fans love it. <laughs> Way to go, guys. The New Berlin Zombies win by forfeit. Again. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. I was it scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. I'm good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.